we're right down to what the defensive adjustments you guys made in the second half, especially in the fourth quarter where it doesn't allow them to get seven yards. I mean, it really was just stop the run, just play our uh, play how we play, read our keys, get down here for real. So all we have to do is just stop the run, get down here, and just play to what we know how to play, like what we've been practicing all week. We knew it was coming, just knew we had to fix it and just get down here more for real, for real. Was there anything that was slowing you guys down early that you guys were able to say, hey, let's, let's stop doing this, let's play our style of football? Uh, I mean, we're aggressive defense, so, you know, we always going to be aggressive, but sometimes we probably can get a little bit too aggressive, but I, I, Coach Bates, he's just a great coach, so second half, he just made the right play calls, and then everything else just fall in place for real. You're from about a few hours away. I have some family here today. Yeah, I have about 40 people here today. <laughs> What you say? I was gonna say, did Cincinnati recruit you? Yeah, they did. I had an offer from Cincy, but Pittsburgh, home. <laughs> With uh, your sack there, I think it was their last offensive drive, second to last offensive drive. What did you see? It seemed like you kind of came pretty clean right off the edge. Just being sharp. <laughs> really, really, we, our linebacker core, that's our name, sharp. So mm -hmm. really just being sharp. You know, fourth quarter, third down, that's money down. That's when players make plays, that's when you get paid. So all I said to myself, get paid. Did it. What do you think um, allows Cincinnati to have some success in the first half against you guys? Um, we kind of started off slow. We wasn't like really dialed into our keys for real. Our D-line did a good job. They always just started linebacker. We got to get doing it downhill. You feel me? We always point, point at ourselves when we ever see something going wrong. It's always linebackers. We got to take, you feel me, take the step needed to get past what we, you feel me, what we need to fix and what we need to correct. I think second half, the linebackers just dialed in more and did our job. This was the first road win of your collegiate career. I mean, especially doing it here in Denver Stadium, what did it mean for you just to be able to get that first one? I mean, this is what I've been waiting for my entire life. So, I mean, it really is. This is a game, but this one was a big win for me just because I had a lot of family here. Really, my first road win, like you said, it's just the moments I've been waiting for. It's a lot of people here, read out. Hey, it's, it's, it's like, that's the games I've been, you feel me? It's what I dreamed of, ready to make plays in these type of games. Sorry. What does a win like this do for the team? It's just confidence, just kind of moving forward the rest of the season. I mean, it's a big win because we feel we have to face a lot of adversity. It's down big, but we just want to know. Next week, got to go one and know again. That's it, bro. When, when, uh, were you in the, did you go with the defenders who went to the, stu the, the Cincinnati student section after the game? Oh, no, I went to my family. Like I said, I had about 40 people here. <laughs> I had my own student section. <laughs> it was what was that good. like celebrating with them? Oh, that was great. We did the fight song right in front of all of them. So that was really like an amazing moment for me. But I ain't gonna lie. Since he, like I said, is up the road. So there's a lot of people here. Just, that was just mind blowing, bro, bro. You guys were on the field for, for a long time in the first three quarters. It was the team starting to set in? No, I mean, like, our high, our offense is high pace. We go against a little dads every day in practice, so we're, we're, we're in shape, man. We, we chasing him around all day, so we was definitely in shape. It wasn't no fatigue, for real. Okay. What's your reaction to hearing uh, Eli was 10 of 11 for 180 yards? You know, two touchdowns in the fourth quarter. Baller. <laughs> Baller, he's a guy. <laughs> he's a guy. That's it, he's a guy. We trust him, you know. We know, you feel me? He probably could have went 11 up for 11. Cause, you feel me? That's what we trusted him to do. But he's a baller. <laughs> That's all I got to say. He's a baller. He needs three touchdown drives. Right he needs three touchdown drives in the game winning field goal drive. What kind of confidence you guys are going out there? Are you seeing that to give you energy to go out and answer that by getting him the ball right back? I mean, we always have trusted him that they could go score with that. We know the first half we started a little slow, but defense started a little slow too. But we know when we get Eli the ball, we good, especially when we got Ben. I trust Ben for, what would you say, goes from 70. <laughs> ben Saul is good for 70 for me, so hey. Ben out there, we good. We know we trusted Ben. Hey.